this is a really exciting study. It's um, uh, an 1800 patient trial um, for early stage uh, breast cancer in patients who have a BRCA1 or 2 mutation, showing that a year of one of the PARP inhibitors, namely Olaparib, significantly reduces the risk of recurrence. Um, Olaparib has already been FDA approved for metastatic breast cancer, um, and it's also used um, to reduce the risk of recurrence in ovarian cancer, but this is the very first adjuvant PARP inhibitor trial for early stage breast cancer. So it's always exciting to see a drug that we uh, use in metastatic disease move into the earlier setting where we're actually curing more patients. Um, some of the interesting things about the study, um, uh, about 80% uh, or so of the patients were triple negative. Oh, so th these were patients who are um, either ER positive or triple negative. HER2 positive patients were excluded. Um, about 80% of the patients were triple negative. So it's, it's extra exciting for this group of patients in whom we currently have no targeted therapy to give after chemotherapy. Um, just by way of uh, review, PARP inhibitors are oral targeted therapies that interfere with the cell's ability to repair DNA damage. And that is a um, uh, BRCA, uh, mutated cells already have difficulty repairing DNA damage, which makes PARP inhibitors particularly effective in that group of patients. Um, in this trial, about 1,800 patients were randomly assigned after completing adjuvant chemotherapy to either one year of the Elaparib versus placebo. And what we found was a 42% um, improvement in invasive disease-free survival, namely uh, at um, three years, the invasive disease-free survival went from 77 to 86% with the PARP inhibitor and uh, distant disease-free survival improved from 80 to 86%, which represents a 43% improvement. So very, very exciting. Um, the toxicities were very manageable. There was actually no difference in serious adverse events among the um, Olaparib versus the placebo group. Um, there were more um, mild and manageable blood count issues as would be expected in the Olaparib group. Um, patients were eligible um, if they were, there are particular um, eligibility criteria that pick out the highest risk patients. Um, and, uh, the study just really underscores the exciting um, revolution in targeted therapies and the ability to move these drugs into earlier stage disease. Um, the study really underscores the need to do uh, genetic testing for all of our breast cancer patients at this time um, so we can make sure that we're making these drugs available to all of the patients who might benefit.